National Taiwan University hospital researchers have made a breakthrough that could lead to a treatment for a terminal lung disease. Thousands of Taiwanese patients live with idiopathic pulmonary fibrosis, or IPF, which causes lung scarring and shortens lifespans. Doctors now say they know the protein that seems to cause this mysterious condition, which can also be the result of infections like COVID-19. <coughs> An inexplicable heavy cough that could be a symptom of IPF. Around 5,000 people in Taiwan suffer from IPF and over 70% of them have a chronic cough. Some neither smoke nor have any family history of the disease. Now NTU hospital researchers say they've found the main cause. We found a new cause of IPF for some patients. For some patients with pulmonary fibrosis, their lung tissues, especially the stem cells, produce a lot of ER protein TXNDC5. We found that once this has multiplied greatly within the cell, it stimulates hyperplasia in the lung stem cells and creates mechanisms for a lot of fibrosis. The study published in an international medical journal suggests that the culprit protein can be inhibited. And the first author is Doctorate of Pharmacology candidate Li Zihan, who is just 27 years old. In the study on mice, we found that inhibiting TX and DC5 could ameliorate pulmonary fibrosis and lung function. Next, we want to develop an active agent to inhibit TX and DC5 and then create a strategy for the treatment of IPF. From diagnosis, an IPF agent lives, on average, the median is probably between two and five years. Many patients need a lung transplant to survive. Presently, we don't have any medicines that are very effective at improving these patients' prognosis. So we hope that developing this new medium will help us design a new drug to result in a better clinical prognosis for these patients. Pulmonary fibrosis has been an outcome of COVID-19 infection for many patients around the world. Doctors hope the new discovery will help improve the quality of all those patients' lives.